Hey there, it's Tracy at Whirls and Swirls Quilting, ABQS Ontario. Today's design of the day is super cool. I'm going to show it to you in a couple of different um, variations, I suppose. So here we go. It's, it's modern-y, so it's really kind of cool. We're going to start with just a serpentine line. I'm really not concerned with whether or not this line is even all the way or whether the lines are all the exact distance apart. It doesn't matter. It'll just make it a little more interesting. Okay, so get a, get a couple going. I'm gonna do one more, I think, because I prefer odd numbers of things. And then we're gonna crisscross across the design like this, but we're gonna add a little something to either side. Ready? Check this out. I come to here, put a circle. Up, put a circle down, circle, now I've got these circles touching, they don't have to touch, you can have them hanging out. So if I was going to do this a few times, I would then echo, we're going to just sneak up this pretend bitch here. do an echo and you can do another one up here or down here or whatever you can also do it with um, a curved uh, a straight line or you could even do it as just sort of a let's go and just do something like this personally I like it better with a bit of a curve to it Then we're going to cut across it, circle, cut across it, circle, cut across it, circle. We can double circle them. To encase them as well if you wanted to do that. The other thing that looks kind of cool is to let the circles sort of hang off. the outside. So I'm just going to go up to there and bring it down. We're going to pretend that this is, say, the ditch or the area where you're going to stop. I'm going to come all the way out and come past it. These don't have to be on a diagonal either. They can go straight if you like. Isn't that fun? So think about all the different things you can do with that. We could do double circles. We could do a different shape when you get to the outside. It doesn't really matter. I think circles works really well with it. Let's do a really quick one here. It's not going to look quite as good because it's not going to have enough lines to it, but what if we came out and we did a double circle? There. Isn't that fun? I love that. So there's a few different variations. And here, these are kind of far apart. I would probably scooch them closer together so you get more of those, so you get more um, lines going this way, but whatever works. So there you go. That's today's design of the day. I hope you like it. Take some time to doodle and we will see you hopefully tomorrow. I'll do my best.